Uh, our film, The Body Remembers When the World Broke Open, uh, tells the story of two indigenous women with vastly different lived experience that find their worlds colliding on the street after one of them uh, escapes a violent incident with her partner. Uh, so it begins as sort of this urgent, terrifying moment, um, but sort of weaves itself into, into a relationship story between these two women. You're soaked, hey? I won't touch anything. The film is inspired by an experience that I had a number of years ago um, in our East Vancouver neighborhood. And I felt that it was important to shoot the film in real time. So it takes place over just a couple of hours. Um, and it was from there that we decided to shoot it in this very intimate way. Do you want to speak more to that? Yeah, so we, had, we, we wanted the actors to be able to experience this emotional journey in a very realist, in the most realistic way possible, um, and also for our audience to, to be placed in that situation with them and to feel like they're in that moment and living it um, as they experience it. So where are you from then? Why? Just asking. Some people feel they gotta talk all the time, hey? I was born in Port Hardy. Is that right? Just popped out there like that. Yeah. You're a uh, you're long ways from home then. So um, you're Kwakwakiwak. My mom was. In preparation for the film, um, we wanted to draw from and um, include young Indigenous women in the process of making the film. Um, so we hired a number of Indigenous youth on the film, both in the um, script development process and um, during pre-production, prep and production, and also post, um, in an effort to um, have a very inclusive, uh, respectful um, process that that really drew from reality um, and I guess was a holistic way of approaching filmmaking and this particular film required that. Uh, the title, The Body Remembers When the World Broke Open, is a, it's a title we borrowed from an essay by Billy Ray Belcourt. Um, he's an Indigenous poet back in Canada um, and we felt that the title spoke to the experiences of Indigenous women and the ways that we carry um, the legacy of colonialism within our bodies, but also the ways that we carry the strength of our ancestors within our bodies. Um, and how it's impossible to forget this moment of contact um, that changed absolutely everything for Indigenous people. I think that the film speaks to the ways in which um, the burden of healing uh, and the burden of labor is placed on the backs of Indigenous women. Um, and so this, this particular film speaks to those experiences of, of, um, of having to find one another and working together. Um, and it speaks to the strength of love and compassion and shared lived experience as Indigenous women. But beyond that, I think it speaks to um, the broader lived experiences of women um, and the ways in which uh, we seek shelter in each other. Yeah. And the way that we need, we need to hold each other up and, and protect each other in, in any way that we can, I think.